Hello everyone, my name is Dr. Alan Grant. I'm a professor of paleontology. That means I study dinosaurs and other extinct life. And I'm here to read you another dinosaur bedtime story. But before we begin, let's play a little game. Can you name this dinosaur? Stick around after the story, and I'll let you know if you are right. What is our story today? Dancing Dinos Go to School by Sally Lucas Dinos Dancing in a Book Dinos leaping. Look, look, look. Dinos landing on the floor. Dinos dancing more and more. Dinos peeking through the glass. Dino sneaking into class. Jiggling, wiggling to and fro. Wiping chalkboards as they go. Dino's reading A, B, C. Dino's counting one, two, Three. Dinos pasting red and blue. Dinos wasting paint and glue. Those silly dinosaurs. Dinos taking every snack. Dinos putting each one back. Dinos running out to play. Dinos cheering all the way. Dinos jumping hand in hand. Dinos digging in the sand. Dinos soaring on the swings. Higher, higher. School bell rings. Stopping, dropping very fast. Chasing, racing, back at last. Dinos leaping. Look, look, look. Dinos dancing in a book. What a lovely story. So, did you know the answer to my question? What dinosaur is this? The answer is Spinosaurus. The sale is a giveaway. We don't know what it was used for, whether it was to regulate body temperature or scare away larger predators, which would have been odd since Spinosaurus was one of the largest theropod dinosaurs ever. We know that it ate fish, but it likely also preyed on other animals as well, just like Tyrannosaurus. Oh, she was a beautiful animal. I hope you enjoyed our story time tonight. Until we meet again, my name is Dr. Alan Grant. Good night.